when we look at this from a distance, what we see is this strong diagonal movement of, of what looks like writhing forms from the upper left to the lower right. And then when we look more closely, we see all the interests that these figures have. This, of course, is a rush of bodies into hell. And so we would expect some kind of devilish, grotesque figures. And this is what we see with their kind of eerie grins and horns there coming out of their head and twisted bodies, some moving backwards, some moving forward in di very different positions. Some of them have wings and then there's, oh, it looks like a serpent down there yeah. in, the, in the lower corner. It's a, it's a maelstrom of demonic torment in a sense. And the end is a seven-headed hydra. And it's fun to kind of find all the heads because one of them is almost lost in the lack of tonality contrast. But there is so much definition with that tonality in other parts where he takes us way back into space here and then brings us forward with the bigger contrast. 